Welcome to this week's speed painting for the 1st of February, 2009. I woke up one morning to this message going through my head. It kept applying to everything that went on, and by the end of the day it had enlarged my understanding about a lot of things, even to our security in the Lord. See what you think of it. Nevertheless, this one word seems to sum up the whole Christian walk. It might even be thought of as God's word, the final word, about all that ever goes on. What does that mean? In Heidi Baker's book, There Is Always Enough, she writes about her experiences as a missionary in which she was often penniless while having to take care of hundreds of orphaned children who had absolutely nothing. They went hungry, she went hungry. They got dysentery, she got dysentery. Yet they looked to her to be their mother and see to them. Always, when she had nothing to give, God sustained them all, healed her, healed them, and sent in their rescue right on time, even multiplying food if need be. Her story is well known in Christian circles and is still going on. However many times she's been cornered with no answer to give, God's answer to all the bad facts has always turned out to be, nevertheless. From having nothing at all, she now heads up several thousand churches in Mozambique and India, which in turn feed the poor, heal the sick, give homes to the homeless. Much is said about prosperity for all these days, as God's intention for everyone who will believe and follow Him. But maybe few people enlarge this concept to mean that whatever would finish them off, physically or spiritually, which the world throws at them, won't be able to do it. Instead of drying up or dying off, we flourish, we flourish. Paul, who ended up the chief spreader of the faith after Christ died, was a round-shouldered, bookish type. He nevertheless accomplished his task despite being beaten five times with the whipping that Jesus received. You recall the scenes in the film, The Passion. Being shipwrecked at least twice, once being in the water a night and a day, and being stoned and assaulted and left for dead. Nevertheless, what he did countered the Roman grip on all the regions they ruled and let loose the church into the surrounding world. Heidi was partly inspired by Jackie Pullinger, who tackled the drugs gangs in Hong Kong from the same stance. When she had nothing, and yet had to take in addicts and heal them fast, and do it despite opposition and threats from the government, the police, and gang bosses, nevertheless, she did it. You might consider this. The Lord's Prayer could be the cover word that aces everything that is against Him in this world's beliefs. Nevertheless, our Father who is in heaven. Nevertheless, hallowed be thy name. Nevertheless, thy kingdom come, thy will be done. You get my drift. Almost anything declared in the Bible could be prefaced with it. When someone strikes you on the cheek, nevertheless, turn the other one. It is appointed men to die but once and then the judgment. Nevertheless, there is no condemnation for those in Christ Jesus. There seems hardly anything written for our encouragement and as an instruction about God that isn't making this point. In fact, the very act of repentance is a response to the fact of it. We turn from what nails us in our bad tracks, because there is on offer a nevertheless. I leave you with one of my favorite images. In the film African Queen, the two people who are its heroes are washed-up types. He's a jack-of-all-trades operating a tiny tramp steamboat, and she is an old maid Sunday school teacher who has just lost everything. They are in Africa when war is broken out between Germany and their country, England, and they decide to do what they can. This means sailing down the unnavigable Ulanga River in the rickety steamboat to ambush and sink the large German patrol boat menacing Lake Victoria. The rapids, waterfalls, leeches, and strandings nearly kill them, and their boat sinks before they can destroy the German one. They're caught and are taken aboard it and are about to be killed as spies. In defiance of their captors, they brag about what they planned and declare that they just came down the Ulanga. When the Germans declare back at them, down the Ulanga, but this is not possible, her proud reply is, never the less. And their upturned boat ends up sinking the German one before they can be hung. The days ahead are looking pretty threatening to us all. Thank God our God has told us, he's demonstrated to us, 
and he still holds out the offer of his nevertheless. You might want to try tagging it on to every problem you face. Has someone wronged and hurt you? Nevertheless, they are one of his loved ones. Nevertheless, they aren't right to hurt you. Nevertheless, he will sort them out over it. Nevertheless, you are forgiven for your thoughts and feelings toward them, just as you nevertheless want to be. Nevertheless, the enemy won't be able to get at you for your attitude because nevertheless the Lord has you covered as you repent. And nevertheless, whatever they've done will not end up harming you. Just about everything is covered by this provision. It is truly the final word.